Cody Rhodes wins the men's 2023 Royal Rumble match. Here are the highlights from his press conference. More than six months after he last stepped into a WWE ring, Cody Rhodes returned at Saturday's Royal Rumble and won the men's Rumble match to earn a shot at the undisputed WWE Universal title at WrestleMania 39. Rhodes entered at number 30 and eliminated WWE Intercontinental Champion Gunther, who had come in as the first entrant, thus allowing Cody Rhodes to get his first ever Rumble victory. The match opened opened up the pay-per-view from San Antonio, Texas and lasted well over an hour with Gunther setting the record for the longest duration at just over 71 minutes. The final two were Gunther and Cody Rhodes. They battled for an extended period of time with Gunther delivering his usual heavy chops, which killed any effort Rhodes made to rally. Over the course of their fight, both men were nearly eliminated at several points. In the end, Rhodes countered Gunther with a crossroads and then eliminated him to win the match. Here's what Cody Rhodes had to say about winning the men's Royal Rumble match and getting to point at the WrestleMania sign. I mean, you know, when you're when you're not working here, the pointing at the sign is like a, a, a meme, a joke. It's a thing. Uh, you don't. It doesn't. I don't think register with anyone, and it clearly didn't register with me until I had the moment to point at it. Um, because it's not just pointing at a sign when you win the Royal Rumble, it's pointing at a sign saying 60-something days at the biggest WrestleMania ever. Uh, you have the potential chance to go on last under the brightest lights on the grandest stage, a ticket that no, no one in my family has punched, and I got to punch it. Um, so I, I tried to give a little, uh, like a little love to where I'd been, because I really appreciate everybody and, and getting me to the point and kind of helping me cultivate the American Nightmare and, and getting it here uh, tonight. But that, that feeling, uh, like I said, I saw Randy do it. And he got mad at the cameraman, Stu, because Stu kept telling him to point at it and the pyro wasn't going off. Is this where you want me to point, Stu? And I was thinking, why are you mad? <laughs> but, you know, Randy, Randy going to Randy. Um, <laughs> But I, I still to this thought like, man, you're just the coolest. I just want to do that and uh, to be able to do it and uh, add my name to that list. Whew. If I really think about it, and I haven't started to really think about anything, it just happened so quickly. To add my name to the list of superstars, wrestlers who won the Royal Rumble, man, we're doing something right. Cody Rhodes also had great things to say about the current undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman Reigns. I've been very careful about saying, even saying Roman's name because it's one of those things that I, I knew and I'm sure he knew. I came back and the first night I was back on Raw after WrestleMania, I was pointing to my waist. Uh, I talked about an interview, a real story of wanting to win the WWE Championship, the one title that uh, has eluded the family. And I'm sure he heard that. And I've watched everything that Roman's done. I have nothing though but respect. And I mean, the scene there at the end of the night is a pretty rough scene, but I have nothing but respect and reverence for Roman. Uh, you guys cover this industry. You cover sports entertainment. You cover pro wrestling. Guys, I can't tell you I'm the best wrestler in the world. Nobody can, unless their name is Roman Reigns. That's the best wrestler in the world. I like to think I'm number two, right? And I always say so that's number three. Whatever, this making list is a disaster. Don't, <laughs> don't take my list that serious. But Roman is undisputed. That's just the best way to put it. He's undisputed and, you know, if, if that is the situation we're walking into in 60 something days of WrestleMania, I can't shrivel under the lights. He's been there before. I haven't. And uh, that's going to take a lot of it's going to take everything I could possibly ever muster up and everything I have, but uh, i got to finish the story. It's real. Um, but nothing but respect for what Roman has done, especially coming, you know, we all experience pandemic wrestling, to be able to come back and remain. And also, critics of uh, certain wrestlers, they get in their head that when a guy's in a position, he's stuck that way. That's who he is forever. His prime example, like, Roman's evolution in the, was the young folks glow up it just continues i saw him on jimmy fallon and just 
what a great ambassador for what we do. Um, absolutely. That's, again, the scene at the end of the night, very rough with Sami Zayn and Kevin Owens, but nothing but respect. Roman Reigns is the only man who can call himself the best wrestler in the world. Cody Rhodes is officially headed to WrestleMania 39, which is taking place at SoFi Stadium in Inglewood, California, on Saturday, April 1st and Sunday, April 2nd. What did you guys think about Cody Rhodes winning the Rumble? Go ahead and let us know in the comments section below. And as always, do not forget to subscribe to F4W Online.